Hey YouTube, Scott Stevens here. Welcome to another edition of WWE 2K22, my requests. Got a few requests that I'm going to get to this morning. Going to do uh, two or three live streams. Uh, this one comes from Hercule the De uh, Hercules the Destroyer. It's a very interesting matchup. Uh, Razor Ramon taking on Rick Titan. And if you remember Rick Titan, he was the fake Razor Ramon. The uh, match is set for the Intercontinental Championship, and it will take place in the ECW One Night Stand Arena. So let's get started. If you have a match that you would like to see, go ahead and leave it down below in the comments. Who you want to see, what type of match, and the arena you'd like to see it take place in, and I'll do my best to play it out. They're a lot of fun. Uh, current day guys, legends, whatever, they're always fun, and, and um, some of the results are very, very interesting, to say the least. This one is, I'd never thought of this one. This is a good, interesting matchup for sure. The real against the fake. Now, I've been looking forward to this one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Making his way to the ring from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, weighing in at 320 pounds, Rick T. Rick Titan. You finally have a champion after this one. And you have to imagine these superstars are feeling the pressure here. You don't come into a match of this magnitude without feeling it at least a little bit. As far as numbers go, both men are, are pretty equal. But I'll still be surprised if uh, Razor Ramon is defeated here. Byron, he certainly seems to be showing more fire. This isn't a uh, student versus teacher match. This is kind of a real guy versus clone match. Very interested to see how this one plays out. I heard this man's been saying some bad things about you, Saxton. What would you and his opponent from Miami, Florida. Weighing in at 287 pounds, the bad guy, Razor Ramon. Talk about an iconic intercontinental champion. Of course, he made the ladder match famous in his wars with Shawn Michaels. And don't forget, gentlemen, few superstars have been able to recover from the Razor's edge. It almost looks like uh, mass confusion. Remember the Killer Bees, B. Brian Blair and Jim Brunzel? Masked confusion. They'd go into the ring and come out each wearing masks. Nobody could tell them apart, supposedly. Looks a little bit like that. All right, here we go. Who's going to lay claim to the workhorse title here tonight? I got I got to favor the bad guy, the real bad guy. Plenty of battles waged over the Intercontinental Championship. And he comes out comes out firing. This business this match could easily be history in the making. Here's a pin for the title. No. You can't pin a guy 4 seconds in. Well, that's not true. I've seen it happen before, but it's highly unlikely. Oh, what a 
shot. In the corner. Oh, nice move. Nice and tight on that one. Some would consider Razor Ramon cunning, while others might call him underhanded. Corey, what's your take on that argument? Razor Ramon doesn't play by the rules, Cole. He plays by his rules. And for Razor Ramon to get the victory here tonight, he has to find that middle ground. Ah, jeez. Looks like he found it. He's going up top. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Who is? Oh, Titan. The big elbow. That did some damage. Absolutely no respect on his opponent. You gotta love it. Oh, and that buys some time. Rick Titan hasn't got any offense going at all yet. Oh, uh, there he goes. Rake to the eyes will turn the tide for the time being. Uh oh, he returns a big elbow of his own. Twice. Suddenly, Razor's having a hard time breathing. And a choke slam to top it off. Rick Titan said, hey, I've had enough of this shit. My turn. No. But Titan does have a finisher. Oh, Scott Hall saw it coming. I'm sorry, Razor Ramon. Uh-oh. men have done pretty much the same moves on each other no surprise that he kicked out there now Razor Ramon has a finisher uh oh oh Titans Titan reversed it and Razor Ramon lost his finisher no still too early Razor going for the big one. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yes, he is. He's got his finisher back, and he's looking to put it to work. The Titan has been sunk. Razor Ramon with the victory. I can. Three stars, very good. Razor Ramon defeats Rick Titan for the Intercontinental Championship. All right. That was a pretty good match. Thank you to Hercules the Destroyer who sent that request in. 
I'll be doing at least one more live stream, maybe two more, a couple of early uh, NWA title matches uh, coming up. I have Dusty Rhodes against Harley Race, and maybe if I have time, I'll do Ric Flair against Dusty Rhodes as well. If you have a match that you'd like to see, like I said before, just go ahead and drop it in the comments below. Let me know the people you'd like to see, the type of match you'd like to see, and the arena, and I will do my best to play it out for you. Uh, if you like the video, drop a like down below if you wouldn't mind. Make sure you turn on your notifications so you are notified when I have new stuff going up constantly. I'm putting up new stuff, at least two videos every single day minimum. And I would appreciate it if you would um, subscribe to the channel so you can see all of the cool stuff I got coming on. Tons of my GM matches coming up. I did finish that. The big stuff is done. And um, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, tons of stuff going up with my GM, um, uh, my Rise ton of stuff going up, and I revamped my universe, so I didn't start that yet, but I'm going too soon. So, um, thank you for joining me, and uh, look for my next live stream. I'll be doing another one shortly. All right, thank you for joining me. Have a great day.